Hey, what's up, Life Old Joe here. Today we are going to discuss the 2021 Netflix sequel horror film, Nobody Sleeps in the Wood Tonight 2. So this is direct follow-up to the 2020 film. This, uh, we're, we're back in our rural Polish town, uh, surrounded by woods. And so we get back to the camp, Camp Adrenaline, for like half a second the camp counselor's killed. But it's a matter of the two twin alien hybrid mutant monsters that escape the basement to then go on the killing spree are then captured by police and then peacefully subdued in a jail cell which i find very interesting but then zoisha is is in the jail cell next to them um and then for some reason the the, the captain brings her back to the house to like get her statement even though he already took her statement it was a little confusing and then she sits on the twins bed which still has the meteorite underneath it and then the black venom goo the tar-like substance creeps up, transforms her, mutates her into the an alien mutant hybrid, um, going on her own killing spree. And then eventually she uh, turns the, you know, the skittish police officer Adam into another fellow alien mutant hybrid. And then they go on killing sprees or attempt to go on killing sprees and he's very, no, people are nice. And she's like, no, it's in your nature. You're going to kill people. And then, like, eventually, you know, the main police department from Warsaw, Poland, comes over and, and you know, subdues him, kills her, experiments on him, what happens next. It was it was an interesting change. I, I, I do, I like when, when stories genre hop, or I like when stories have a protagonist become a, uh, a secondary character. Um, it's interesting. So, Zoysia was the protagonist in the first one, but she was a secondary character in this one. Adam is the protagonist in this one. His journey as a skittish police officer turning into a alien human hybrid going on his will I kill, will I won't kill, what happens next bit. It was interesting. I liked the change. I liked the difference. It was more sci-fi. We talked about meteorites more. We get more of an alien backstory because it's now ingrained within the changed psyche. It was interesting. It's the... That's the best word for it. Interesting. It wasn't great. The first one was much better than the second. I like the genre hop, though. I, I It kept me entertained. It was much shorter. This was like an hour and a half. Very, very grateful that it was much shorter. But uh, it was good. It's, good. it's a good horror film. Had some good kills to it. And that's really it. I know no fun facts. On to the next review. Mucho mahalo.